While the world is struggling with energy and environmental issues, Spain is working on one of the cures, high-speed rail. With the initial Madrid to Sevilla lines in 1992, bringing the Andalusia region closer to the Spanish population, rail has proven as a cost-effective way to move Spain's middle class for tourism, commerce and connectivity. Then in 2006, the Madrid to Barcelona service came online. This turned the Midway Point city of Zaragoza, formerly a trucking shipping center, into a transportation and business hub. Along with cities like Toledo and Malaga being connected via high-speed rail, the success has allowed Spain to show the world its high-speed rail prowess. It has allowed Spain to build an exportable economy on that unique expertise. From developing innovative rail management processes to designing line control systems, even creating modern energy efficient train cars, Spain has made their rail industry the envy of growing nations. The technological innovations, from switching systems to car construction, and the science of advanced train maintenance have been refined during this high-speed rail industry growth period. The Spanish have improved train car operations, attributes and repairs of technologies by creating an understanding of aluminum cars and composite floors, how balance rigs help trains corner easily and comfortably at high speeds, looking into track-side gauge switching systems for improved international service, and most of all, the innovative signal time Da Vinci system for high speed safety and route tracking. Adiv has uh, made a lot of efforts in improving uh, the public transport and the efficiency of uh, their system. The main, uh, let's say, technological developments that we have provided to the rail sector aluminium manufacturing of uh, car bodies articulated union between cars. This gives a very high level of rigidity to the train while at the same time maintaining it as a very light. High speed rail which is a quite complex market because uh, for controlling trains in high speed you need a lot of systems. So this technology, the, the technology that you need for controlling trains at 300 km per hour is quite complex. The gauge of our, of our rails is different from the European one, so we have had to develop systems for automatic change of gauge. Independent wheels is also another very important aspect which improves the train in terms of energy efficiency. Guided axles, which improves the speeds of trains in curves while maintaining a very good level of comfort for the passenger. The idea of Da Vinci is the same. We are integrating information from different technologies, from different systems. We are making a very composite system, like the knowledge of Da Vinci. Now capitalizing on a success in high-speed rail, Spain has become a leading bidder in major global transportation projects. For MIT's Technology Review, I'm Jason Ponton.